Hasn't this been a great day? Have you learned a lot of things? Yes. Again, a wonderful, everything moved smoothly. I have a great staff here in the School of Public Health. If you haven't followed us on Twitter, we're tweeting back and forth. Josh is still telling us he's having a great time. Um, <laughs> But, uh, and, and uh, Dr. Abney has already retweeted us and said she loves us. Um, but it is, this is a special day for us, and I know that some of you have had a long day and been here all day, but um, there are two things. One, I see the doors standing there with their yellow tag things, but, uh, so when you leave the room, please throw your tags in, because we're sustainable, recyclable. Um, but first, again, let me remind you, thank you very much to all those who've made this day possible. And that's from the people who contributed their science, their time, and this wonderful final panel. By the way, all of this is taped and will be linked on our website. So if you weren't here in the morning or you had to leave before one of the sessions ended, they're all there. And we want to thank our uh, producer back there who's done all this. Wonderful job. Um, but I have one more thing to do, which is really fun, and that is Jay Magaziner and I, my colleague and my partner here in crime. We are not running for office, by the way. <laughs> but I will tell you that the school has a one, if you're retired, the school has a wonderful program called Legacy Leadership. And this is a program that runs in the state legislature, our state's legislature, and they are trained first on how it works. They, so the fall, you learn how it works, and then in the spring, when the legislature opens, you work in one of our legislators' offices. I already have a seat reserved for when I retire. It's fantastic. They, you know, those of you who have special skills, you can write um, policy. You can help them research policy. So just a shameless plug for the Legacy Leadership Program. So what are we doing? We are now giving the awards for the posters, and you can have the. Here we go. This is. Da, 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 da. Okay. Okay, so go ahead. I just shake hands with Yes, okay, you hand out the awards. So this is the undergraduate award. Um, I guess I go in this order. Honorable mention to Jocelyn Bravo. Is Jocelyn here? <laughs> Jocelyn, what's your department? What are you, what's your undergraduate major? Yo. Congratulations. These are, you'll get a little plaque and you also, I think there's, and this is just a plaque, right? Then, okay. First place, Elena Tron, Tran. Woo hoo hoo! And Elena, what's your major? Community health. Community health, all right. Note community health, ACEs out public health science. Okay. Master's degree students. Well, this is a long list. We have um, a lot of, is this all of these? All of these Oh, this is a group project, okay. Um, honorable mention for the master's degree is Elizabeth Bell. Elizabeth here, all right. And Elizabeth, your Getting your master's in? Yo, all right. An honorable mention of this apparently was a group project, is that right? Indiana James, Diamond Green, McAllister, Egbry, Malin, Amanda Pumphrey, and Lucy, Luciana Asadi. A good thing I don't read these at graduation. Maiton, is that right? Maiton, yes. And you're taking the award for the team? There you go. And what, where did your team come from? What's your major? Uh, they were from so that's the whole team is from that? It's from Dr. Mary Geiger, research team. Oh, nice, the hair project. Yes. Nice, wonderful. Congratulations. And first place to Catherine Campbell. Woo! Ooh, you're all here. Sometimes this happens. Oh, that's probably how everybody got to stay here is because you thought you might win one of these, right? And you're doing your master's in? Public health. Public health, Public health what? And epidemiology. Oh, okay, there you go. Thank you. Your concentration. In Baltimore. Baltimore. Woohoo! 
<laughs> Welcome to College Park, Catherine. <laughs> Is that right? Go Terps. <laughs> So again, these are two authors. Is that why the um, this is the honorable mention? There's two names here. There's actually two because of the number of doctoral posters. So there's two, two honorable, honorable mentions. Okay. So the first honorable mention um, in the doctoral category is Daisy Lee. <laughs> Woo is Daisy here? It she not be okay. And and this yes, I have class really. Jennifer Guida is the other honorable mention. Congratulations. Oh, -hoo. and Jennifer, you are getting your doctorate in what? Epidemiology. Epidemiology. That's why I heard a shout out from Dr. Gold. <laughs> Congratulations. So it looks like we had another tie, is that right? So uh, first place, not only do we have a tie for honorable mention, but we have a, a two first place winners that are tied. Lily Fountain. <laughs> Lily Fountain! Now this is a Baltimore person, no? <laughs> Lily, where are you getting your PhD? Psychology right, psychology. and you're on the faculty in nursing. Yes. Yes, fantastic. <laughs> Woohoo! Be sure to tell, give my regards to Jane Kirshley. I will. Thank you so much. I think you need that picture again. She was looking away. <laughs> and the other first place, Teresa Smith. <laughs> Teresa, and your PhD is in kinesiology. Well done. <laughs> Remember, this is Public Health Research Day, and one of the reasons that Dr. Um, Magaziner and I envisioned this day when we were starting to work as collaboratives, uh, as a collaborative in public health, was that we thought it would be great because everyone would want to come together and share the research. And as you saw in the posters and by the involvement of our graduate students, we have succeeded. So again, thank you to everyone for staying to the last minute, and to our winners, Oh, yeah. Can all of the winners come up here for one big group picture? Thank you. Again, thank you all for a wonderful day.